cool days there's the men to be able to plow down trees. Oh! oh, there you go. oh. Hey. Here we go! Full steam! Woohoo! Welcome to the video, ladies and gentlemen. Today, we're going to look at something very special from the Expansion Project mod team. You've already seen me get pretty excited knocking down trees in the Fatmobile. They have also got the yellow sedan working in-game and, of course, the helicopter, the little bird, what we've all been waiting for. It's very much work in progress and, of course, unofficial by the mod team. I believe this is their first test on a live server environment with other players to see the performance of the helicopters in-game. And for the most part, when the server wasn't crashing and we could get one to take off, they worked pretty well. I was surprised how smooth they flew and desync was pretty minimal to none. Oh. oh, oh God, he lived. How'd he live? How did you move? Here we go. Oh, dude. Lack of boss. This is good. Is there no roll? It's just turning left and right. Oh, is that okay? Yeah, take off, lean forward, lean back. Uh, I'm not sure what slow down is, so. Yeah. Dude, this is smooth as hell, man. This is good. Now we got a land. I'm not. We're gonna crash. It's not gonna be a landing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Of course, being very, very work in progress, we did have issues. So I'll stick some uh, kind of outtakes from when things didn't quite go to plan uh, in the video as well for you guys to enjoy. Ah! Jesus, what's going on? Uh... Oh, no. Oh, no, watch out. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Oh, God. Uh, help. Oh, he's coming down. Oh, uh, where did he go, Logan? Into the floor. Oh, there's a helicopter. Whoa. <laughs> he killed me. He just flew into me. Now, going back to the Digger Fatmobile, I think the potential for this to be a base raiding tool would be pretty epic. I think it's going to be hard to actually get to a base. It's pretty slow. You're exposed a lot. But if you could get it there to knock down a base and get in, I think that would work really well. So we'll have to see in the future how that would pan out. I mean, you could take it through trees to clear a path maybe for vehicles or just use it to uh, finish off a base. Maybe if you've killed all the players held up in a base, put it through the war, easy access to their chests and all the loot get geared and uh, leave the place but uh, it's still very much work in progress again it did destroy pretty quickly when we knocked down a few trees so but the potential is there let me know your thoughts on the fatmobile and its potential use in DayZ in the comments below other than that we did have a pda system to play with so if you're familiar with exile or other mods that may have used a pda system in the past for armor 2 or armor 3 you kind of know what to expect we could group up and have a map and view our position and possibly our group member positions as well. We also have the option to place markers on the map so we could plan out an attack on a base location or something similar. Now, the best thing for this, in my opinion, would be for new players. Using my father as an example, he is into DayZ quite big at the moment. He plays it quite often on our servers. The amount of times he's told me he's left the town and turned up two hours later back at the town from running through the trees in a big circle, I couldn't tell you. So using this PDA map system with markers and your location, as well as group markers, would be great for new players. They'd be able to find their friends easier. Of course, it's been a long time requested thing from a lot of the community, especially newer players, and being able to learn the map a lot quicker, knowing their current location just by simply looking at the map in their PDA. Of course, they can then go onto more hardcore servers where they would be knowing the map a lot better from using the PDA system. Of course, there's many other uses like we've mentioned, but I think this would be the main one for newer players to learn. And of course, if newer players are enjoying Daisy more via learning the map and knowing the map and what they're doing and where they're going, more of these newer players are going to stay playing DayZ rather than rage quitting from running in a circle in the woods for two hours. I got your back, pops. The expansion project team also has smaller additions like custom load screens and custom community messages, which is a pretty neat idea. Something else for you to stare at while you wait to load into the server. 
potential for community servers to have maybe top supporters of that server have their own messages or images on the load screen. I don't know. Let me know on your ideas of that in the comment section below. Now, in the future, I would like to get a quick interview with some of the expansion project mod team. So if you have any questions, please put them in the comment section below and I'll read through them, of course, and pass some over and see if we can get some information for you guys. Like, can we use this on our own community servers later down the line and things like that? Of course, as always, I will leave a link to the Expansion Projects Discord server in the description below, as always. So you peeps can go over there yourselves if you wish to do so and keep track of their work. I just want to say a huge thank you to those that have continued to support me even through being AFK for quite a while. Whether it be from simply being a view on a video or giving a like or sharing my video elsewhere, to supporting me financially via Twitch subscriptions or being a Patreon. Every little does help. Don't forget you can support me on Patreon from as little as a pound a month. And it does add up, guys. It really does. And it really helps to upgrade any certain PC parts, which I am, of course, working towards at the moment before my PC explodes and I can deliver you even better quality videos and much better quality streams. So I thank you from the bottom of my heart and I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe if you enjoy the content I create. Let's talk about this in the comment section below and I'll see you peeps next time. Looking good, but you're smoking a bit. Oh, off he goes. Oh, goodness, that's pretty quick. He's going to crash. Guaranteed he'll be back here in a second. Yep, there he, there goes. he goes. There he oh. goes. Oh. 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 <laughs>